Welcome to lecture number 58 of the series Unreal 5 for Aquis and in this lecture we'll learn about decals so let's get started applying a decal on a surface is actually pretty easy let's go into the Megascans library I'll select decals and here we have different types of decals that we can add into our project let's open graffiti collection and let's try this one okay I'll select this one and I'll add this into my project in medium quality and all I have to do is bring this material instance into the scene. Now let's scale this down on Y axis. Let me disable snapping. Let's move this on Y and place it here. Let's pull this up on Z axis. And let's scale this down. Let's move this on Y. And I'll rotate this on X axis by 90. Okay. Let's uh, scale this on X like that. And let's rotate this on X axis by 90. Yeah, I think I should rotate this on Z as well. And um, let's scale this on X like that. And that is pretty much it. Okay. Yeah, let's delete this one. Now what I'll do is I'll download a mud splash sort of decal from the Megaskins library. I'll open Quixel Bridge. Let's uh, go into the decals and I'll select this mud collection and let's try this one. Okay. I'll add this in medium quality. Yeah. And before I apply this decal on this surface, first let me hide this grid. For this, I'll go into show and I'll uncheck this box. Okay. Let's now bring this material instance into the scene I'm going to move this on X and Z let's rotate this on Y axis by 90 ok and let's scale this on X I'm going to move this on X and place it here yeah ok and let's move this on Y and place it here. I'll create a copy on Y axis and place this one maybe somewhere around here. Now I'll select both of them. I'll select this one and this one as well. And I'll create a copy on X axis by pressing and holding Alt on my keyboard. Let's place it here. Let's fractionally move this on X. I'll select this one and let's create a copy on X axis. I'll rotate this on Z by 90 and I'll move this on Y axis and place it here. Okay. Yeah. Let's create another copy on Y axis and place it somewhere around here. Yeah. Let me select this one and let's move this on Y. Yeah, I think this is okay. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing for this fence as well. Okay, so for that, I'll go into Megascans library. I'll select this leakage collection and I'm going to use this decal. Okay, let's add this into the project. Let's open this folder and 
and I'll bring this material instance into the scene. Let's pull this up on Z. I'll move this on Y. And let's rotate this on X axis by 90. I'll move this on Y axis by 90. And let's pull this down on Z axis. Yeah, there it is. Maybe place it here. Let's scale this down on Y. I'll move this on Y axis. Let's pull this up on Z. And let's place it somewhere around here. I'll open this one and let's bring down the opacity intensity to maybe 0.5. I think 0.55 will be okay or maybe 0.52 yeah I think this is okay 0.51 let's move this on x-axis and I'll place it here okay yeah let's create a copy on x-axis I'll place it here. Let's adjust the position. Yeah. Now I'll select both of them and I'll create a copy on X axis. Let's move this on X. And I'll place it here, okay? Okay. Let's now select all of them. And let's create another copy on X axis. And place it somewhere around here, okay? Yeah, there it is. I'll select this one. And let's create a copy on X axis. And place it here. Maybe here. Okay. Yeah. Similarly, I'll select this one. And let's create a copy on X axis and place it maybe right here. Okay. Let's open this material instance and I'll increase the opacity intensity to 0 0.6. Yeah, I think 0 0.6 will be okay. Let's bring this down to 0.55. Okay, yeah. Let's go into the outliner and I'll select all of them. And let's create a copy on Y axis and place them against this fence. Okay. Let's tweak the sun sky value. Yeah, now it is visible. Okay, yeah. Let's select all of them.
I'll select these two as well. And let's create a copy on Y axis. Let's go into the top view. And uh, I think I should hide the foliage actor. Yeah. Let's rotate this by 90. And I'm going to place it right here. Okay. Yeah. Similarly, I'll create a copy on X axis and I'll place it on this fence. Okay. Let's now unhide the foliage actor. And let's go into the perspective mode. Let me increase the camera speed. Yeah, I can see these decals. Yeah, it's there. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we have applied this decal on the entire fence. So that concludes today's lecture. In the next lecture, we'll have a discussion about lumen, which is one of the most important topics in this series. Okay, so make sure you don't miss that one. Okay, so I'll see you guys in the next one.